Hey guys, this is Nitrobex. Uh, sorry for being a little dressed down today. Um, yeah, still recovering from Vape Fest. Okay, so I am feeling good enough now to talk a little bit about it. Uh, first thing you might have seen in my little teaser video was um, the mustache mirror. So, um, it's called a mofo. Uh, there's a email I'm going to annotate in uh, over here. Okay, you can get a hold of them. Uh, I did talk to them. They're going to be going out to many, many stores very, very soon. Uh, they got three different styles. Uh, they got the kind of curly Q one I got. Uh, they got one like it that has tips, and then they got like a bushy one. So, uh, and there's. The Tag for it. M O F A U X S. Vape like a sir. Um, picked up some other interesting stuff there. Um, the big ticket item I got. Juggernaut hybrid, and we'll be talking more about this in depth later. Um, got a bunch of little odds and ends that aren't too interesting to look at, but we'll talk about them, um, in depth later. Um, other interesting things that's unveiled there, um, analog. It's an energy drink. Uh, the guys from, let me get this right on the side, Penanal, Juicy Vapor, and iVape came up with a series of uh, energy drinks for vape meats, vape stores, people that like energy drinks. Uh, analog is the sugar-filled one. Now, if you're like me and can't really have a lot of sugary drinks, they have digital, <laughs> sugar-free. Um, I did drink a couple digitals. They were pretty good. Uh, I don't know where you can get these from yet. I would definitely keep your eyes on uh, Penanal.com or JuicyVapor.com or iVape.com. Um, got a whole bunch of liquids. So um, let's take a look at what actually happened during Vape Fest. Uh, I got a whole lot of video footage there on the first day when it was nice and quiet. On Friday it was really quiet. On Saturday I took one big walk around. Um, had a bit of a shootout there with uh, P. Bissardo. Um I think he has microphone compensation issues, so we'll find out. Um, Hope you enjoy the video. All right, so next up we got Stormy's Vapor Cellar. And if you don't know about Stormy's, they do a lot of internet business. Uh, they're giving away free T-shirts. Uh, they got some kangaroo evods, um, some juice, SVC and wood. Looks very nice. They got a couple nice little mechanicals. The K100. They got the smoke telescope. They got a kick. AJ18. MK, uh, or MKBTS, nice little mechanical. I, I can't believe it. it Two batteries, yeah. a nice little startup pack, and the EVA. They also got the Terminator, and the Terminator small, so uh, definitely a nice choice here. Uh, and let me get their back stock up. So they got some stuff there. And there's your stop. All right, so these are the guys from Vape New York. And the first thing I notice about their table is not this gentleman's lovely face. It's a shirt behind them. It says, if it looks like a cigarette, you're doing it wrong. I really definitely appreciate that. They got some nice stuff here, especially for beginners. They got uh, the Ego Style Mod batteries. Uh, they got a couple little Ego. They got the U-Can, which I'm probably going to come back and uh, check out a little bit later. Of course, we've got some batteries here, truss fire charger, uh, looks like good old boats. 
Vision Eternity Dripper, a couple Agatees, a uh, couple Bams or uh, Silver Bullets. Or not Bams, I'm sorry. Um, Silver Bullets, yeah. A couple Proberry. Beautiful blue Proberry with extension cap. And in case you have a vapage or buy one here, they have the nice custom cases for that little bottle. Again, these are the guys from Vape New York. Well, I'm the guy from Vape New York with Spike, who's actually up front of the table. This is one of my buddies. Spike's over there. <laughs> yes, Spike and I are Vape New York. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> I appreciate okay. it. That's absolutely fine. All right. But you got the guys from Vapor Knoll, or uh, if you've been vaping for a while, you might remember them as Vapor Bitch. Uh, they have uh, beautiful tanks here, the matching drip tips, uh, just simple cardamizer tanks, and they have a handful of their most popular flavors, and of course, their infamous shirts, uh, it's not smoke. It's okay, so our next booth up here is Volcano, we got Serious Vapor Clouds. Yeah, what's up? We got Shadow over there. All right, so let's go into what they got here. Well, we got our famous lava tube, which is all seven colors. We got pink, gold, blue, red, black, chrome, gunmetal gray. Quite popular device. We got our infernos, which are our ego-based devices. We got uh, some clear, mega clear misers. Uh, one of our smart chargers from X Star that we retail for them, and then ten of our most popular flavors uh, that we currently hold right now. Just All so you can USA see what made flavors, made right here in the USA, batch tested, all that good stuff. Okay, so having a bit of issue again back there. Morning Company's back there. We can't see their booth right now, and I'll talk about why in a second. <laughs> uh, you also got Penanal and 310 Vapors. Uh, they actually had a couple juggernauts. I uh, managed to pick up one. I'm um, going to sneak over here and see if they're actually all out. Receipt. He's going to email. They have one juggernaut left, it looks like. They do have some noble ones. And they have some juices, uh, freebie giveaways, and some that you can try. And they got these nifty little mod holders. They look like, uh, are those paracord? Like safety? Yeah, exactly. like, yeah. So, no longer just bracelets, you now can have a mod holder that can save your life. <laughs> all right, next up we have Cherry Vape, and all I can say is Holy Drip Tips Batman. Any color you can think of, and they're all the standard Cherry Vape, really good quality. They also have some liquids here. A couple little starters, uh, uh, SD hearing. Oh, All right, yes, guys. so walking in here, the first booth you got as you come around is Mount Baker Vapor. They have some t shirts, some can koozies, which will probably be used later. Just tell them what you want to try out. And of course, some of the one, juice. You guys sell the big bottles, right? Like the, yeah. you have like Okay, next up we got the guys from OKC Vapes, and I have to mention, they have a really awesome looking truck with a vinyl wrap outside. Um, of course you got the Proveri clip holders, um, they got a drip can, it's kind of like a uh, U-can, but rather than have to dump the whole thing out, it has a bottle inside so you can switch out flavors on the fly. Kind of a great little idea, it's got a little plastic... It's a standard 10 mil bottle. Show them the plastic piece on the side. So, you got a nice little plastic piece where you can press to get the juice. And a nice little needle tip up there, standard 10 mil. So, that can keep you going for a while. Of course, they got their. And it's got the fluid level on the side. Oh, nice. There's a little window. Let me get in so I can get a mat. Little sight glass. So you can see how much liquid you have left. <laughs> All right, and then they got the Vamo, of course, and then the one device I really wanted to see from them here, the IC. Beautiful mechanical mod. Uh, it's got nice little colored rings on it. Uh, so everything I've heard, uh, vape spray. I might look at picking up one before I leave. Um, they got the vape mod. 
a nice little bottom feed dripper. And rebuildables, rebuildables, rebuildables. Small terminators, large terminators, Phoenix style rebuildables, wick wire mesh batteries. And they got a couple of juices out on little uh, egos, so you can try on that. And once again, these are the guys from the OKC Vase. All right, next up we got e-pipe mods and talk about e-pipes. Lots and lots, any kind you can think of, some nice big ones. You got the long stems, you got the shorty stems, you got the fat stems, and you have juice. Is there anything else you could want? Oh yeah, they have the U.S. and I've never figured out how to pronounce that, correct? Yes, box. Box, okay. It's USB AUX. It's like. box spelled funny, it uses an <laughs> AU instead of an O. It's kind of what they do. But uh, he actually just showed me the switch assembly on these. It's actually kind of uh, genius. What they do is there's a magnet down in the bottom. The switch has a magnet too. It's all t held together by magnets and it has an ego cone thread. And from what I've seen, they have a beautiful throw on them. And that's how hard it is to take the battery out. That's a quick overview of the vendors I could get to on day one. Um, there were a few other vendors there. Um, back in the corner by Mon and Company uh, was Caveman Vapes. Uh, had some nice mechanicals, some nice rebuildables. Mon and Company had a bunch of Zenesis and um, uh, Trippy Tips. Uh, so those were very nice. I did manage to actually win a glass uh, tip there by having a Raspberry Vape. Um, Let's get into some of the stuff that is not just vendors. So this next uh, series of videos is some stuff I took a closer look at. This is still on Friday. What would a vape meat be without a bar? And being in New York, we passed Coney Island, so they do have food, and this was what everybody was around. Hot dogs, french fries, chicken tenders, and ziti, I think. Yes. Ziti. So these are the guys from Cherry Babes, and I just got to find out they have a nice new product. So let's take a look. Um, okay. Well, the, the weakest point in your drip tip is your o-ring and because of the different size of atomizers and carnomizers out there and the heat and the contraction that's probably the first where, where it breaks or if you drop it so what we've decided to do is we came out with a new product we call the ringless ming and it has no o-ring and we came out with a short universal it's available in white or black delrin and now this marries to your carnomizer atomizer or tank with all the different shapes. It adds a heat buffer, so there's no heat transfer and no weakness in the, in the uh, bottom of the mink. Also, if you have uh, odd-shaped drip tips or if you have an odd-shaped tank or uh, some of the rebuildable tanks I've found, or some drip tips don't fit at all. Mm -hmm. This will friction fit in there, and then you could use a standard drip tip in there. Also, if you have glass drip tips, it's better to have a glass drip tip against this, the, the Delrin, black or white, than against your metal. Right. Okay. We do have one more thing, though. For anyone that already has a Ming that's broken, the next thing we have, what you do is, after it's broken, you can just take sandpaper, sand it down to a flat section, the, the flat ring around there. We came out with the Ming Bowl. <laughs> the Ming Bowl, you just pop your drip tip into there, just like a knucklehead, and it swivels around. So we didn't stop there. We eliminated the O-ring because it was de Delrin, and you could have a friction fit right into there. And at the same time, if you've got bad eyesight like me, and it's late at night and you've been drinking, it makes a really good target dripper. <laughs> <laughs> that thing is friggin' enormous. Just like that. Eventually we'll be migrating uh, all of them. Not all of them, but we'll just keep some of them migrating the O-ring list into a lot of our drip tips. That's awesome. Well, I definitely appreciate it. All right. All right. 
second booth we got up here is DKS Liquid. No, ma'am. Nice. They got some nice leather holders. <laughs> National Organization of Men Against Amazonian. <laughs> Amazonian Master. Nice. It's a beautiful device. What uh, what batteries does that run off of? This runs either an ATM 650 with an adapter, or you can use twenty Big baby. And it got a built-in wave safe. Nice. It got a built-in wave safe. A space for the kick. Nice. And look at that atomizer. Ten milliliters. <laughs> How many coils? Fifteen. <laughs> oh. Uh, Double coil, mesh and double coil wick is possible. Nice. At the same time. You could wait mesh and wick at the same time if you want. So you could run quad coils. And with three extensions, <laughs> it puts out over a hundred watts. <laughs> this is no joke. <laughs> I show you the wick I what, use for this. What if I wrap my coils, all four of them, at half oh. an ohm? <laughs> <laughs> I show you the wick I'm using for this. Zero point three two millimeters. Nice. This is huge. Yes. This is huge. So on top of it, they have some nice little leather cases. And we got a special edition by Wape Lab. The nine millimeter. Drip nine millimeter in B color. Only 75 pieces for the New York Wave Fest. They won't be rebuilt no more. Nice. Those are, what are those? Yes, button. Got some DKS e liquid. DKS 100% natural. The propylene glycol is made out of corn. Nice. So, so we, pat yes. we patented the first liquid in the world that is completely natural. Zero nicotine, it's double concentrated, so you can cut with nicotine up to 50%. It means, because they are natural, so you can mix each other without any strange combination. If you mix coffee and vanilla, it's a wonderful coffee and vanilla. And for example, our cinnamon is made with cinnamon. We have also the tobacco, we extracted the tobacco flavor from the tobacco leaf and removed the natural nicotine that is in it. So it's a very different experience. Very nice. If you want to I'll be back for when I don't have the camera. Okay, so Friday night I did catch uh, the big raffle giveaway. Uh, they had raffle tickets. If you ordered online, you got one. You could buy one for five dollars, or you could buy five for twenty. Um, there was one gentleman that had a couple hundred dollars worth of raffle tickets he won a lot and you'll get to see this I did not unfortunately catch the uh, Saturday raffle on video I ate through way too many batteries um, yeah so after that they also did a smokers check so what you're going to see is uh, Spike's going to ask some questions and you're going to get to see the people responding in the room by raising their hands um, I thought this was kind of interesting. Time right now. So if you have your raffle tickets, please get them out. And so the way I understand this is going to work, first of all, hello, my fellow vapors. Um, the way I understand this is going to work is that we're going to call numbers. And if you have the number, you won the prize. But if you're like one number higher or one number lower, you also win. Is that the way it works? Or do they have to come up here and fight it out? If no one has the number... Okay, if you don't have the number, if the number uh, gets called and nobody has it, the higher number automatically wins. If the higher number isn't here, the lower number then wins. And what if nobody wins? You get the prize? Then we do another number. Okay. It's with all the cameras. Hi. Okay. Here we go. This is where you hand me the ticket. 
Oh, you want me to do that? We should not let somebody else do it. I can't. How do you get your hand in there? Hold on. We'll do it like this. The winner, the winner will pick the next number. How about that? All right. All right, here we go. Here's the first one. Five nine one four seven seven. Five nine one four seven seven. You just won a pipe from Vapor's No. Four bottles of juice and a mofo. We have a winner. One four seven seven. Look at that! Congratulations. Vapor's Knoll, Mount Baker Vapor. Flavors by Joe, Hangs in E-Liquid, and MoFo. Thank you for the prizes. That's the one. All right, congratulations, and you're going to pick the next winner. If it's mine, I pick that. Okay, that's nice of you. Here we go. All right, Spikey, what's the next prize? <laughs> okay, this is funny. This is um, every flavor that DKS Liquid makes, which is like the same box those guys sent me, and it took me forever to get through that review. Okay, here we go. The winner, 365148. 365148. See, like, that's the box that you guys sent me. All right. 365148. If we don't have that uh, ticket out there, the higher one will get it. And if you don't have it, the lower one will get it. Who's this from? All right, one more time. 365148. How about 149? Okay. It's a whole box. It's like a giant, it's like a gallon of liquid here from Italy. They have tobacco parmesan in here. 365, 148, no, 149? No, 147. Does anybody actually have a ticket? <laughs> so we want to do you want to call another one? Should we just move it along? All right, let's move it along. I have to go back in again. Okay. All right, here we go. Five nine one three six six. Five nine one three six six. Come on, I got it. I got to check Phil, that. Phil. Okay. Phil. We got a winner. There you go. Matt from E Pipe Mods. It's the Are you gonna put? The hey, put that in your pipe and vape it. Yeah. There you go. You gotta pick the next. Here you go, Matt. Pick the next one. Yes, you do. Yeah, okay, absolutely. I just want to say thank you to DKS for coming from all the way from Italy for our Bay Fest for the last couple of trips. And I'm glad they have so much fun that they keep coming back because we love them. They're a lot of fun. Their flavors are phenomenal. Go by there and try them if you haven't. I'm telling you, their tobacco parmesan is out of control. All right. Here's the next one. 314819. What's the prize anyway? What's the prize? What's the next prize? Black. Thank you. A what? A toughie tank, a, a toughie tank from Vape Dudes. Four bottles of juice. Or what's in the bag. It's like, let's make a deal. Okay. 314819. Do you have, who's got it? Yeah, really, Jay? Seriously? Come up here, man. Get up here. Hurry up. Jay DeLugo. He makes clear water. It's awesome. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, well, you're the one who let the recipe slip out, don't I guess. Okay, is that it? 819? Wait, what does he want? With that? Now, do you want this with the tank juice or what's in the bag? Hmm. What's in this bag right here? Go with the bag. Go with the bag. No, not my P-Mod. 
Hmm. Big decisions. The bag. You gotta show it, right? You gotta show what's in the bag. Hmm. All right, we got a couple bottles of juice from Mount Baker Vapor Vape Dudes, Hanks and HK Hanks and E-Liquids, and flavors by Joe and Terminator C Stormy's Vapor Cellar. Terminator C from Stormy's Vapor Cellar, rebuildable. And if you have any questions about how to use it, go over there. They will show you. Come on, Jay. Good job, Jay. It's nice. All right, here we go. What is our uh, next prize, Spikey? I'm not used to being behind a microphone, by the way. It's my first time. A drip on demand, that's cool. What else? And a bunch of flu, uh, a bunch of liquids, right? So this is getting moved aside now. Okay, a drip on demand and a bunch of e-liquid. The ticket number is 591382. 591382. Here we go! Good job. Look at that. Drip on demand. Most people see a doctor about that. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, yeah. I tried, man. I just, not a comedian. All right. All right. All right, don't read it yet, though. Next prize is going to be. All right, what's the next one? Oh, looking good. A Tesla. Oh, <laughs> oh I'm giving away a Tesla. Imagine that. All right. From who? iVape.net. Okay, so that is a nice prize. Another or what's in the bag, right? Okay, here we go. 591 432. Oh, I know. I tried, I tried for you. Really? Seriously? Well, you bought every raffle ticket in the house. There it is. So do you want the Tesla or do you want what's in the bag? I just bought a Tesla. Take the bag. You take the bag then. It's, it's clear. So I take the bag. I just bought a Tesla. Yeah. So I need the bag. But he has to say what's in the bag, right? He has to say what's in the bag. Okay. What's in the bag? I don't know. It's an e-liquid and a tank. Got the Hankson and the Here you want. and a flavor. We got a Tuffy tank from VapeDudes.com and four bottles of juice. Hankson, Mount Baker Vapor, flavors by Joe, and I don't remember. Who, oh, that's it. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for sponsoring. All right. So the Tesla is still up for grabs. Is that the way we work this? Or you didn't think that one out there? Okay. All right, so the next prize. We got a pipe? A pipe from epipemods.com. That's those guys in the back corner there, Matt, who was just up here and won. Is this the, is this the next ticket? Is this the ticket that got drawn? Just go to the right now and get your tickets. You don't know? I don't think we drew one, actually. Yeah, I don't want to pick one. They'll blame me if they lose. I don't want that. Fair and unbiased, right? Okay, the uh, the pipe for me, pipe mods five nine one four one eight five nine one four one eight. You just want yourself a pipe from e pipe mods if you're here. Yay nay. Five nine one four one eight. We'll go to the next higher. How about 491? Or 419, rather. Just like you. 419? No? Oh, here he comes. Wait. Do we have Shut a wiener? Up. Yeah, buddy. There it is, 419. Yep. You got the next one. I'm here wanting a pipe. And you got one. You got a nice one, too. All right. What's the next prize? Thank you. Marie. See 
Matt at Give me your address and your email. I'm gonna send you the bus. Cherry Mave, are we gonna be donating another one of these tomorrow, or is this for today and tomorrow, or am I splitting it up? Anyone? Cherry Mave, Cheryl, Matt. Cherry Mave's another world. Okay. Cherry Mave. We're giving away some Cherry Mave drip tips, or oh, I think it's hard. Come on. These are, by the way, there are original. Cherry Vape tips only made for Vape Fest. You cannot buy them online. You cannot get them from your Cherry Vape vendor or dealer. You can only get these here at Vape Fest. So, we are putting up all of the Cherry Vape Mings in a whole package for Vape Fest Cherry Vape Mings. Or a Tesla. Ooh, that's a tough choice. It is tough. You know, for somebody who's losing their voice, you like to talk a lot. Okay. 591-340. Come on. We have a smoker here. We're supposed to announce that, right? Welcome. Welcome to the fine world of vaping. She has no cigarettes with her. What kind of smoker are you? Go buy a pack and bring them back. And then we'll crush them in front of you. <laughs> You smell her, right? I thought there was a smoker right here. Congratulations, April. What did you pick? The, the, uh, the, the tips or the Tesla? Going with the Tesla. All right. Wait, wait, wait. Pick the next winner. Smart girl. All right. The next prize. Ooh, 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 ooh. Careful. Hold on. We're tangled. Okay, here's the prize. We got a Vivanova. We got, what's a tubby tank from Vape Dudes. We got a bunch of e-liquids here. Or what's in this box? It's kind of smooth. Smoking Joey. Okay, Smoking Joey gave up the uh, the Vivanova for this. Or what's in the box? That little box right there. All right, here we go. Five nine one two nine five. And we, uh, we need somebody to help this smoker out. Is that what I'm supposed okay. to do? Okay, we need a volunteer to help the smoker out, and we need uh, the winner of this uh, drawing here. 591 295. 295? Yay, nay. We're going to go up one. I got 9 4. You got 9 4? So you got to hope there's no 9 6. That's what it works. All right, how about uh, 296? 296? No? She told me to wait. I'm trying right. for you, man. All right, yeah. I'm going to get on your bad side. I'm going to get on your bad side. All right. All right, last, uh, last shot, 295 or 296. Yeah, I know. 294. Sold. There you go. What do I win? Now, what do I win? You get to pick this pile here or what's in that box. And we don't know what's in that box. Not a clue, but you're going to have to tell everybody. We went with the box. It's a box of cigarette butts. Congratulations. What's in there? Uh, a bunch of Addies. A bunch of Addies? No, wrong with that. I'll take it. Who's Addies? Who's on there? Do you know what I'm on there? Perfect. Hey, hold on. Pick the next winner. Congratulations. Much happy vaping to you. All right, here we go. Next prize, Spikey. What do we got? Okay, so the um, the prize pack that we just talked about, or the um, the cherry vape tips. Okay, five nine one four four four. Five nine one four four four. Danielle, pay attention, please. Okay. Trying to keep up here. I'm trying to move this along. Five nine one four four four. No way. Seriously? You know, there's always people like this who just have the most incredible luck in the world. I 
Oh, and, he bought, and he bought $100 worth of tickets, too. That probably helps. More than 100 <laughs> What She said 100 A shitload. Okay. Another V Vinova I bought. And you get all this good stuff, too. another one of these. Or that. Or that. Or that. Don't get, don't get greedy. Or what? Or this. Exclusive only for vape. Went with the vape <laughs> There you go. Cherry vape. I told Chris I couldn't find. I put all my my cherry vape tips together, and I can't find my book. Now you found them. They're all in that one bag. Okay, here, wait. Pick the next winner. You should be like an old pro at this by now. Mine goes back. Pick me, pick me. Look, it's like you've done this before. <laughs> You don't have to look at the number. You were checking for your own number, weren't you? Okay. All right, here's our next prize. Is it the pile or the charger? Okay. The pile that we're trying to push or a nice trust fire charger. Oh, you added a giant miser, a giant to miser to the, uh, the pile. Okay, so either are good, right? Trust fire charger and a t-shirt to the pile. We are really pushing the pile here. Okay. <laughs> All right, uh, here's the next ticket. It is 365130. It is 365130. We got more for the back. Spike, you still accepting giveaways? Yeah, we got to do them. How we doing? Tomorrow, yeah? Okay. No? Again, 365130. Let's go up. Can they hear in the back there? Sometimes I'm really quiet. Three six five one three zero. All right, how about one three one? Everybody has a vote. One two nine. I was kidding. You really didn't have to. Like, do <laughs> cool. Huh? I needed one. All right, how about um, one two nine? One two nine. Three six five one three zero. One three one. One two nine. How about another number? All right, in between. In between. We're gonna have a change. Here we go. Guys, what I want. All right, does everyone know what your favorite top to vape is? Like yes. Top. You know, I don't mean top. Like your favorite topper. Okay. Anybody who is right now vaping, Phil's favorite topper. And knows that that's what his favorite topper is. Yeah, but I don't know what my favorite topper is. Well, you have to know. That's why I asked you. What's your favorite topper? You don't know? All right. He's going to tell me which top. He's going to pick one. Hold on. Silver mod. My silver mod. Okay. Any... <laughs> the first four people... Pay attention now, first four people to come up here vaping a Cardo tank. We'll get a t-shirt. Box. Here we go. Alright, alright, alright. Going, going. Never mind. <laughs> oh, not a Cardo tank. Oh, it's ours. Can I take the orange? Cardo tank. Box, there's a Cardo tank. It's all on top. This is in the Cardo tank. Okay. No. Okay, guys. We still have an EVIC, a multi battery charger, a whole pile of stuff that we're trying really hard to get away. I'm throwing a hat, a Vape New York hat, in with the pile of stuff. I'm putting it all in the hat. We got a Tuffy tank, a VV Nova, a giant demiser, and four bottles of juice in a hat, and a Vape New York hat, okay? So it's either that or this charger. The EVIC comes last, right? Okay. Is that upgraded to the latest firmware? Did you take care of that for them? You don't know? Somebody pick a winner. Anybody, please? There you go. All right. How about this? 591-439. 591-439. Choice between the hat of stuff or the trust fire charger. Come on. Really? We'll do it one more time. 591-439. Are we close? Like horseshoes? No way.
<laughs> They're gonna start saying it's rigged. I'm not gonna do it. All right. Half these tickets. <laughs> All right. Trust fire charger or bag of or hat of stuff. Yeah, feel free to browse a little bit. Look around. Okay, okay. Did you want to open the boxes too? No, no, no. Put some of the liquid on your finger. Make sure you're happy with it. <laughs> I apologize, Spike. I told you not to get somebody. I apologize. Somebody stole my hat. Somebody stole your hat? In a bar. So that's why I had to win this. All right. All right, here we go. Take another one. All right. Charger in, in the shirt. All right, so we think the charger came from Smoke and Joey. If we're not, Spikey's fault uh, and the uh, the T-shirt. So that's the next prize: five nine one four one six. Oh, I, I know, I know the pain, the pain. Five nine. I like when like somebody goes, ah, oh, it's me, and they come on the post. There is something on the back of it. Try to read that. Zinfared at gmail.com. Also, if he's not here, he wins because he put the name on the back. Oh, did you tell everybody that? And, and tomorrow night, it'll sound like this. All right. Be Evic. Nice prize. Who is this from? Oh, no. She knows. She's going to let us know. Mount Baker Vapor. Nice prize, Evic, okay? Uh, you want to pick? Shake him up. Shake him up. All right, here we go. For the Evic. Three, one, four. Eight, four, eight. That's okay. Three one four eight four eight. You just won an evict from Mount Baker Vapor. Or you're not here. No, there's no there's no name on the rack around. Alright, we're gonna go wait. Wait. Three one four eight four eight. No. Not today. Oh wait a second. We got we see we got somebody excited running up here. 314-848. Shut up! Shut up! Yeah, shut up! There you go. Give them a round of applause. There you go. Very nice. Congratulations. I gotta tell a real funny story about this guy. He came in, which vape, was that Vegas Vape Fest or was that Chicago Vape Fest? He came in, he's like, my batteries are all dead. I have nothing to vape. I was on a train. I lost all my stuff. I don't know what I'm gonna do. So everybody gave him vape and he was all vape and happy the whole freaking weekend. And then someone stole something from him that he found it or your credit card, something like that. It all works and, out. But it all worked out. So thank God for Vape Fest, man. Congratulations to him. Thank you to everybody who helped us raise the money. Everybody give a big round for Phil. Thank you for doing the announcement, saving my voice so I don't go to dawn by tomorrow. Um, if you guys, I, I wanted to do one more thing. Can I have you come around here and stand up on this chair with the camera a second? Guys. Everybody in the vendors, please pay attention. I need you to all listen and answer the questions by raising your hand. If you used to smoke, raise your hand. If you used to smoke more than one pack a day, keep your hand in the air. If you still smoke, raise your hand. <laughs> Thank you very much, everybody. I appreciate that. Let's give a round of applause for all the smoke-free people in the house. See you that was Friday. Friday was kind of a lax uh, day. Did have a good time uh, just sitting at the tables, talking to people, walking around, getting acquainted, uh, understanding my surroundings, um, buying stuff. So, we come to Saturday. Saturday, the place is packed. We show up early. A couple of us get in there super early. We get kicked out because there's going to be a line of people there. Um, 
we wait out in the lobby, build some coils. Um, everybody apparently thinks I'm a vendor because I'm walking around with my case of stuff, building coils. No, I was not selling them. I was building coils, helping people troubleshoot stuff. So, um, I shot a quick video, which is not so quick that you'll see. Um, but after that, I put the video camera down and I did two community service loops with new vapors. Uh, that was a lot of work. Um, and I built probably 40 wicks and I don't know how many coils. Um, vaping one of them right now. And this is the CCTS without a kick with a 1.1 ohm on a Agate. So that's a lot of what I was doing on Saturday. It was a great time. Uh, tons of people at our table. We had Vapor Joe, we had Smokey, we had uh, Rich Teller Vape, we had Walt, uh, super great guy. We got Nikki Darling, we got uh, William from Mad Cat Vapors, uh, we had Stormy or uh, uh, Shadow coming in and out. We had um, we had a lot of people there. Uh, Most Angry Pirate. We had um, a, a lot of people. I'm sorry if I missed your name specifically. We had a lot of people at our table. That's only the tip of the iceberg. So um, it was it was very fun. Uh, it was great. Uh, after the shops closed down, a lot of the vendors came over our table. Uh, Bruce from uh, Clouds of Vapor. We had um, Joe from IVAP. wasn't even vending this event. We had uh, Vapor Al from Panano. We had um, Andrew from Juicy Vapor. We had the list goes on. If I name it, this video will never end. So uh, let's go ahead and look at this quick walkthrough. Um, I apologize about how long this quick walkthrough is, but it was a lot to uh, take in. Um, also, this is where you'll get to see me and uh, P. Basardo talk about our cameras and microphones and our Pro Varies. The silent auction table still up. Alrighty, guys, listen up. We have raffle tickets at the front desk. Five for one, five for twenty. Get your raffle tickets. We're gonna have raffles all day. Good prizes, guys. Come check it out. More vendors. More vendors. Okay. Find people from Volcano moving stuff. The guys from Vapor Knoll. Stormies. Not quite set up yet. Um, I mean, set up is I'm never gonna be. Okay, set up as they're going to be. <laughs> We're gonna be doing a rebuild class here soon. I'm gonna go to talk to Spikey and I have it announced so everybody can see how we rebuild. What do I need to bring for my rebuild class or than my juggernaut? Yeah, really? I'm doing a rebuild class, which is for uh, trippers. Okay, so I should bring my Phoenix. That would probably work. Could I drip on the juggy? <laughs> yes, you can. Okay, C's moving some product. Guys from Sherry Ming. Where did that smoker go? E pipe mods. We have a smoker, fresh and cigarettes. Raise your hand, let me go. Good Smoker. profits. Okay. This guy right here, this is Steve. The guy's from Steve Blue again. He's going to help everybody out and show them how to use stuff. I got 25. Uh, you, you have people in here. You have people showing you. All right, you have press dudes. That's great. See that man. Redondo beach. Scary shit. Yeah. Clouds of vapor. E liquid planet. Going great. Got some nice trippy tips. We got slide running away for something. The awesome, sorry, the awesome bartenders from last night are back again. They are quite awesome. 
The cook is back for day two. And more great food. ZD chicken fingers, uh, french fries, and hot dogs again. No, burgers. Oh, burgers today instead of hot dogs. We're, we're kind of close to Coney Island. How come burgers and not hot dogs? Well, I'm a burger guy. Burgers and beer. Well, the beer's over there, so you're in lieu with the bartenders today? Well, yeah, it's, it's my bar, my food, so I get it. The guys from Vapor Craze are back with quite a few less hybrids. I'm just going to hold the camera on this guy for a second. He'll do something funny in a minute, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm very commercialized. <laughs> yeah, you're so. <laughs> <laughs> is that the camera? I just said, wow, there's this there. Why don't you show us your see my face in the camera? Other way. Been around and there. There we go. I see my towel. Why don't you show us your product? That type of product. No, no. Yes. The first ever vape beverage, analog and digital. This is sugar and sugar free. We can do it in different flavors. As far as the sugar and sugarless, we can do it in different ways. But this is our, our sugar free version, and this is our um, sugar version. We're try it out. Hopefully you'll find it at a brick and mortar near you. So what does your favorite buddy call that mod? Oh uh, yeah, I gotta switch it. The Tesla? Yeah, what does your favorite buddy call it though? My favorite buddy? Yeah. The one from uh Boas, Alabama. Oh, oh. Tess. No, Tesla. Tesla. You gotta get it right. We got oh, Ewoks and Teslers. Oh, Tesla. He also doesn't like Panite. Panite. You like Paninal? What the heck is Paninal? Paninal. <laughs> I don't know so what a pan seven words. Seven words. We got more Zens. We got some very beautiful drip tips. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful drip tips. And rebuildables, rebuildables, re you have the AGR tank. He has the AGR tank. Flying out with them. Flying out with them. AGR, Phil Ford on the top. I'll be doing this play here. I'll uh, do the sales bit. And that's how you drop your locking cap for the AGR. <laughs> In true caveman fashion. Everything's always harder on camera, isn't it? Nah. Well, especially when you Hang on, I need to spin this way for just a second. And this is how it works, walking around with a camera. Okay. When you put it together, you throw your cardo in first. Do me a favor, yank on that for a second. So they can see it doesn't move. No, that ain't coming out. He doesn't like his balding. That ain't coming out. Can't push it out. Look at look look at the capillary action on my finger. I'm pushing hard. It does not come out. It's got O rings, they don't leak. Now, what's the tank made out of the the tank portion? This is gonna be your uh, high density polyethylene, H E B. So can you put like citrus turn. in it? Yeah, it, it's not supposed to turn, but this is Mick. It's made in China. So you, you get in, you get a twenty dollar tank, and it performs like a twenty dollar tank. Twenty dollar tank. You know, you can get the Zen. And it's the Zen. Right. Now they also have this lovely little device that's not an empire that is not an empire it's it's similar to but it's not an empire can you show the button on it absolutely this button here and the threads are sick on this the threads are sick they're nice and smooth bottom fire button good throw this, uh, you see the construction of the button on the inside i'll take the spring off it's got a nice c-clip retainer it's all chrome plated brass which brass 
metallurgically is more conductive than aluminum. The threads on the telescope are nice and thick. The smooth. Now I'll take an 18650. 18650. Will Can you kick it? Will not kick an 18650. The electric angel will kick an 18650. And there's the electric angel. And that's how you drop. See, that's, that's called. Everything's camera. harder on camera. Hey, no, actually. Huh? 18500 will kick. Yeah, it will kick 18500. The, uh, if you've ever watched any of my videos, you know I drop everything. It's part of the quality. But this is a drip shield. You got a cartomizer that comes with it. We've got an entire kit. Ego threaded. It's got lots of bending on it. It's it's a good it's a good mod considering where it was manufactured. No. These glass tanks. They're supposed to be. Uh, by my demise, it is glass. My, my surmise is glass, and that's why I'm selling them the same price as these tanks. That glass? I replaced the tank. Uh, yeah, I replaced the tank on it. Um, when I bought the AJT2s, they're supposed to be glass. And yes, guys, I'm vaping fluid today. And you know, now, when I bought it, they're like the T2 is glass tanks. Okay. This is the only one here that has this. I'm the only one with the electric. I'm not so worried about the electric angel. Oh. Oh. Yeah. You want to tell me about your ceramic wicks? One eighth diameter. They're designed to go in the Zen uh, atomizer. It's quartz ceramic, which is good between 2,000 3,000 degrees. When they get gunked up, you torch them clean. You start them How do they taste? It just depends. They have some break-in period that goes with it. Uh, and there's not a lot of people out there that have used them. Yet. Right. Uh, those reviews are coming steadily. I got you. That's how it makes sense. <laughs> I like the sign language. I don't have to say anything. And that's how it works at Vape Fest. You point to what you want, and they go, take my money. Dueling cameras. What's going on? Not much. What's going on, sir? Not a lot. Not a lot. Just chilling at the You need to trade with me? Huh? Are you trying to shoot him? Uh, no. I talked to him already. I'm going to talk to him again, maybe. So which camera know. are you using? I'm using a, uh, what is it? I don't know. Panasonic. I see you have a Canon. I have a Canon. I like my Canon. I like my Panasonic. I like my Canon. I like my mic over to the side, so I have the nice little comfortable hand grip. I know, I don't have the comfortable hand grip. I, you know, yeah, like, I, hang I, on. I wing it. <laughs> God, I'm sure what I got. God, yeah, I know. Yeah, you got the what? nice little backpack, but I, I got that. You extend the battery, yeah, I see what you got. I see what you got. All right, so you're showing me up with the camera. But, just for the record. You get more views than no, I do, no. though. Just for the record, can you go ahead and please film the length of my microphone one more time? Okay, see the length of my microphone? Microphone. Yeah. Now let's look at the length of your microphone. Okay, enough said. <laughs> I think somebody's compensating. This is the argument Absolutely. I always have when I'm vaping my mini. I have to. <laughs> like, see, I vape a Proberry mini. What's he vaping? <laughs> well, no, not extended. It's just a, a regular Proberry. I like to consider myself average size. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, so well, that's the next they got some nice tanks here. Uh, they got the ceramic wicks, which is one thing I really want to see here. I'm going to have to come back and tell this gentleman to take my money and see if they fit in the AGAT. You'll have to cross to your AGAT to do an 8 inch Okay. Just let you know. Will it fit in the juggernaut? Huh? Is it an 8 inch hole? I have I have no idea. I wish I could get I a juggernaut. I bought it yesterday. <laughs> Where'd you get a juggernaut? Sorry, here. Those gentlemen, yesterday. How's business business? You already had one? I already bought a sandwich. Good morning, I got my juggernaut. They had three juggernauts yesterday. Yeah, they're gone now, right? Oh, they yeah. were gone. They were sitting right here. We've got it. <laughs> okay. Thank you. So moving down, we still have that really big ass mod. And what's that? The sidewinder looking thing. This is an Italian mod called Da Vinci. Nice. This is a bottom feeder for 18650 batteries. You can use 18500 and a kit. All mechanic. 
Does it have an integrated tank or is it a cartomizer? You got a bottle in there. And it shoots off into an atomizer. Just there. Squeeze a little and pumps up the liquid. Nice. Very clear taste. Very nice. That's a beautiful device. And yes. So, guys, uh, look for the device called the Da Vinci. And we got the guys from DKS, and you're from Italy. Italy. Yeah. All the way from across the pond, and then some. Now, they brought. <laughs> I got your face. Don't worry. Here, I'll make it so you can see yourself. <laughs> they, you're on camera. <laughs> Um, they came over, they have some lovely juice here, all natural and all organic. Yes. Why didn't you bring the olive oil? <laughs> Why didn't you bring the olive oil? I have family over there and they always bring me this lovely olive oil. You should have brought crates of olive oil. We can't get good olive oil over here in the States. Olive oil. Yeah. They, they bring me, where they go to is, uh, it's, um, Right out of uh, Sicily, mm -hmm. they bottled the olive oil there and they put like garlic cloves in it. Okay. Wow. Next vape fest you come over, I want a bottle. <laughs> <laughs> but their juice have, is made with all but, natural and all organic. But we patented the first liquid in the, in the world that is completely natural because the PG is from corn, it's not from oil. That's the difference. Right. So, there, so it's not only organic, it's more than organic. Right. So it's actually natural. Instead of using oil, they're using corn to make the PG. Yeah, exactly. And the uh, yeah. flavoring extracts are extracted from what it's from. Yeah. yeah. So exactly. like vanilla tastes like vanilla. It's yeah, not it's like chemical. Like vanilla. It's very simple. Vanilla beans. This is the way. Yep. And they're making really awesome boats out of their flyers. <laughs> that is some skill there. <laughs> See some seal. Not only for bucks. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's fly down here. And you can't tell what these guys sell at all. <laughs> There's no telling what they're selling, and they're still unpacking more. Let me get their sign because it has everything you need to know. Yes, it's Mount Baker Vapor. The guys with possibly the cheapest juice prices ever and better quality than the keg. <laughs> $4.99 for 15 mils. Same day shipping. They're great guys. The only thing I'm upset about is you only brought how many flavors with you? Ten. They only brought 10 flavors. How can you show up and only bring... Oh yeah, they brought a whole lot of each of the 10 flavors. <laughs> Okay, so coming over here, just doing a quick pan over the crowd. So we're still early in the day, not many people are in yet. And what's really cool is they do have. William saying there, that's going to get my mod for a second. They have a smoker's table. And I'm trying not to shoot the gentleman sitting at the smoker's table so I don't scare him away. But if you're a smoker and you show up here, this gentleman will walk you through everything you need to know to get off of cigarettes. Tell you how everything works. And then they're going to give you a tour around, kind of like I did to all the vendors. And as you've seen from the walkthrough, if this gentleman can't help you find something to keep you off of cigarettes, there's plenty of product here at great prices, and being Vape Fest, they're handing out a lot of stuff. Well guys, this is Nitrobex. This is Vape Fest Day 2. And uh, I'm going to shut down the camera for a bit, go chat, have a good time, and I'll check in with you in a couple hours. So, you've stuck with me all the way through this, and I definitely appreciate it. So, I figured I'd reward you with something kind of a little rare. Um, it's a juice review. That's kind of what I'm known for. But I got my hands on some really, really rare juice. Right now, I understand there's only 15 bottles in existence. Uh... It's from Mad Murdoch, same guy that makes Pluid. It's Maharaj, it's a Sisha vape. 
Oh, hey guys, this is Nitro, Vex Reviews, and I'm They're coming to you live show. from Vape Fest. Sorry about the background noise, this is going to be a little bit different than my normal reviews. I got my hands on something kind of rare. I got Mad Murdoch's Mahara. First look. Really good flavor, it's really nice and deep. You do very much get a seashell um, flavor off of it. It's a nice coating on the back of your throat. What is it? It, it is just a little bit more direct um, inhale. It wouldn't be an all day bait for me, but it is pretty damn good. Um, this one's a home run for Mad Murdoch. See you soon. <laughs> I never